friends. I'm here today to talk about the metric system. Last time we were here, we looked at our ruler and we were looking across the top at inches. If we go ahead and flip this over, you're going to see that there's some smaller numbers here and a lot more. These are called centimeters. Each one of these little lines is called a millimeter. We are going to be measuring to the nearest centimeter though. So you can see just like in inches, there's a line that's a little bit bigger that is halfway. If it is before that line, we're going to go to the smaller number. If it's after that line, we're going to go to the bigger number. When you're thinking about centimeters, you can think about a large paper clip when we have it that looks like this. When I measure, I wanna make sure I start at the line, not the ruler this time, because I can see where the zero starts. So one large paper clip is one centimeter. So I can add and keep going for each centimeter. So if you're at home with me today, you can think about that large paper clip if you don't have a ruler handy. The other thing that we look at when we're talking about the metric system is a meter. A meter is about the size of an adult baseball bat. Let's go ahead and look at what that looks like. I'm gonna grab my tape measure here because this one is again bigger than my actual camera. So I'm gonna keep going. You can see we have inches on the top here and we have our centimeters on the bottom. Keep going. And there we go. A hundred centimeters is one meter. So again, there's that whole thing. Let's look. It's nice and big, just like when we talked about our yard. It takes this whole tape measure. So again, to recap, we are going to be measuring in the nearest centimeter. You wanna make sure if you're using your ruler that you're on the side that says CM for centimeter. The little tiny lines on this ruler are called millimeters. So those little millimeters make up one centimeter. Okay, so 10 of those equals one centimeter. But when we do our measurement today, we are going to do to the nearest centimeter. So if it's before the halfway mark, it's going to be the smaller number. If it's after the halfway mark, it's going to be your bigger number. If you're at home, don't forget that you should be thinking about one centimeter being the large paper clip. Or you could think about a pinky finger. When you're thinking about your meter, you want to think about an adult-sized baseball bat. All right, it's your turn to start measuring.